Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we're playing some Raid Shadow Legends and we're going to try a challenge. <laughs> yes, um, I wanted to try and do a challenge in Arena where I only use Hegemon and no Ray, which means I will replace my Hegemon with Skull Crusher. That way my team can get counter attack. I don't know what good that will do, but I figured why not give it a shot. And yeah, I just want to try different challenges nowadays a little bit ahead, you know, like try different varieties of things and try and test my team to the limit. How good are artifacts? How good is a, how good is a setup? You can compare like if you have two rays, they may be completely different. One may be way better than the other one. And that goes for any hero, uh, of course. So yeah, without any further ado, let's get right into it. It's currently 2.38 a.m. I wanted to record with uh, Stu Gaming, but it seems like he's not around. So I'll, I'll do a late recording. Probably the latest recording I've ever done. <laughs> uh, right now, I felt bad for not having uploaded in a, in a little while. So yeah, anyway, I will not do anything with my Ray. She will be where she is. I'll not ungear here. Gear, gear her because my skull crusher is already ready. He has a lot of resistance a lot of good stats and Yeah, let me just see here um, Yeah, let's uh, yeah, let's let's do it. Let's do it. Uh, I will I will just uh, Give me 50 this sounds awesome there we go, okay, I guess I'll do a video with, with him as well, which is cool. That means I have two videos coming up, yay. Okay, cool. Anyway, yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's play around with Skull Crusher. Uh, I definitely want to wanna try and do that. Uh, so I think that I'll just refresh. I do definitely want to get to Gold 4. So I think this is a, just a nice way to farm it as well. So goodbye, Ray, and hello, Skull Crusher. I have no idea how this will go. I've never used Tegmon as my only damage dealer. This is actually the first time me trying this. Uh, so yeah, he will he will be my he will be my, my damage dealer. I can't do I like nobody else is a damage dealer essentially. So this is all this is all I'll have to do. And I'll try and take out the Tormin, and he will freeze himself, and I will get myself some counter attack. And this is awesome. I've never like Tormin like so many people I've I've seen. A good amount of people with Tormen and like he is nuts. Like people are saying he's crazy, and I can I can I can agree that he is a super crazy hero. And I wish that I would have gotten him, but I you needed like a crap ton of voids, which I did not have, uh, and I will not have, <laughs> uh, not in a while anyway. Maybe I'll get Tormen at some point. He's so OP. I hope that I could get him at some point. If he, if from like a void shard, you never know, like it, it's possible, it's possible. You can never, oh, someone got Ignatius, that's insane, he, that guy is OP. Uh, yeah, let's, f let's fight a full legendary team at 120k power. I know that I'm 168k, but that's just because of all the HP. Doesn't like, it doesn't necessarily mean that my team is like ultra strong, because at, at the moment I only have one, one hitter. My team isn't tanky, so if these guys get like a... Well, I, um, I'm doing kind of fine right now, so I'm not going. I'm not going to talk too loudly, I suppose. Uh, yeah, let's just simply take this guy out. Should be easy. Uh, there we go. You're going away, racing scar hide, and there we go. I guess I was provoked. Uh, let me just see if I got the response on that. Uh, okay, sick. Okay, sick, sick. I was going to say sick, yeah, because. Anyway, yeah, it's going to be awesome. Let's see, 120k power. I wish that... I feel that after Platinum happened, gold in general has been become way... Okay, well, I barely dealt any damage there. I just feel like gold has become easier, and I don't really... Is it, is it easier, or is it just me? It may just be me, but I feel like it's like it's easier, but I, I don't know. Also, this is amazing how the counter-attack works. I love it so much. Uh, do I care? Uh, let's just uh, weaken the Karam and the Crisis Terminator. Not the Karam. Uh, Lord Kimar, right? Um, no, that's Lord... Sh Lord K Kimar? Prince Kimar, right? Prince Kimar, obviously. And Lord Shazar, Prince Kimar. <laughs> I must not make the mistake of confusing those two together. So I can just decrease some Terminator and let them die by poison. That's easy, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. 
Um, whom else would I want to fight? What about you? 97k power. Let's let's refresh. I do have the gems. I can also I can also fix the masteries right now. Uh, I'm not going to do it tonight, but I will maybe do it in like another video very soon, coming near you very soon. Uh, sick. Okay, so this team was uh, a little bit easier than anticipated. Anticipated. It's going to be my turn one more time. I'm going to do a, do a death burst on the Tormen, and I'm going to do a stone wall. And luckily I'm not frozen by the torment, which is awesome. I will also just decrease the torment. Okay. I'm not sure what happened there. Anyway, let's take out those guys. Then it's only torment remaining. And he is a very resistant man. <laughs> He's resisting everything, man. Torment truly is heavily resistant. And he has his defense increase as well. Is he going to freeze me? Does he have the accuracy? Because he does have the resistance of, a, of an insane person. He genuinely has. Like my Hegemon has 220 accuracy. And to this Torment is just being immune to everything. <laughs> he, he's resisting literally everything, man. Is he going to resist Crippling Cold? He resisted it, but he didn't He didn't resist to dying, unfortunately. But yeah, that must have been an, some heavy amount of... That must have been an insane resistance... On that guy, like he resisted everything. Oh my god. 99k power, what about you? 112k? Uh, let's see here. Do we have anyone which could be interesting? Let's refresh one more time. <laughs> um, level, full level 60. These guys have an Arbiter. With 137k team power, this could be very good actually. So let's see here if, if we can beat these guys. These guys could be... These, these could could be a problem because it, it's not too late for them right now because if their Arbiter, Arbiter gets their turn which I think she will, she will revive, increase her meter and increase her attack which means I'll have to uh, I'll have to see if I can take her out okay so her turn meter was reset which just makes it easier for me yeah she didn't she didn't get a turn and therefore they lose I think that Relic Keeper was nerfed recently, wasn't he? I, I, I think so. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't read patch notes as often as I maybe should. <laughs> While making content of this game, I probably should read the patch notes a little bit more often than I than I am doing. Let's increase my own attack and boost my turn meter. Let's also just do some Blight stuff. And then I will... Hmm, I think that I will target Lysandra because she is annoying. Lysandra is pro definitely the best hero in that team, I think. Draco, it, like, Lysandra is the best in PvP in that team, I would say. Let's also decrease the, the thing of the Skull Crusher. And then, I guess, I will take out the Skull Crown and her, which is awesome. And then we only have um, the Longbeard uh, left. And isn't he the one taking people with him? while fighting like he he carries he takes his uh, his allies with him and he's not also this is a void uh, void legendary here uh, I guess I'll have to uh, names like I know the names before like all the new heroes started appearing and now I'm like what what hero is that and, and such and I don't like it <laughs> now I actually I like it obviously new heroes and new challenges new strategies it's all it's all good it's all very good um yeah let's check out uh gorgora v2 here there we go i should make a video didn't i didn't i already title that gorgora v2 with that guy i think i've already done that if not then that's an ingenious video idea <laughs> in it we in it blood twin yeah i i've yeah i've seen that guy i've heard about him anyway I think I covered him in like a showing new heroes video. Let's see here. Do we have anyone else? Mm, 90k team power. What about you? 111k. Nothing too interesting. 20k. Heck no. What is a heck no? I mean, hell no. Nah. Hell no, nah, man. Hell no. Uh, 81k. Could we find like a good uh, a good final battle p by chance? 96k. Should I refresh one more time just just in spite to do it? You know, like to to get a final insane battle. 
Oh, this could be good. Yeah, this is fair. Full legendary team with Alessandra's carry. And uh, these guys have a lot of good heroes. Let's see if they're going to win or not. I genuinely think that this will be easy and this video will have, have, have had not too much excitement as I wanted. So maybe I need to get further into gold where I can do this. Then I would get enemies, which is my bat rating or power or whatever. And then it would be better. Also, yeah, I counterattacked. I was like, why is my team going crazy? And I remembered, oh, yeah, like we counterattack a lot. Uh, let's just do that. Take out this guy, Lysandra. Uh, she's nuts. I don't think I care about her at the moment, though. Yeah, let's just do that. I'm skill locked. Doesn't matter, dude. Let's uh, do this and decrease their, their duration things. Then he is gone, and then I will decrease her speed. Heck yeah. Then I will increase my own turn meter and my attack. And she should die. Goodbye, Alessandra. You didn't really make it too far. There we go. <laughs> Sick. Easy, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Yeah, let me actually see if I could take a screenshot. Whom should I... This is, this is clickbait, guys, because this doesn't actually happen in the video. So if you're seeing this, I've actually just clickbaited you. Okay, thanks guys so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy, leave a like, subscribe. Hopefully the Stu Gaming video will be good. And yeah, that's about it. Have a nice one and bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.